What's going on you guys? Just Matt here and today we're going to be reviewing the brand new Tidal Basin update that just dropped yesterday for the Division 2. I'm actually really excited about this update. Been looking forward to it. However, I don't think I'll actually get to experience it right offhand, especially the new in-game mission. Uh, what I got playing in the background right now is a website I'll put in the description below. It has all the patch notes and everything in that that was included yesterday. That way you can do some research and find out what they improved as well. And here in a minute we're going to actually check out a trailer I found for the first year roadmap so to speak that Division is going to use when they're going to start releasing even more new content this year so if you bought the one year season pass you got a lot to look forward to this year so let's go ahead and let's check out this trailer and let's see what they have to offer <laughs> Agents of the Division, as the Black Tusk invaded Washington, D.C., they left their stronghold exposed. We found a breach. They will not expect us. This is our chance to save the nation. Invasion unfolds the story of the battle for D.C. and will be deployed across three updates. Starting with Title Update 2 that introduces the most heavily defended and dangerous stronghold, Tidal Basin. You will need to gear up and collaborate with other agents to take on this new challenge. This update adds two new exotic weapons. Three new gear sets giving you specific bonuses for new play styles. The first apparel event to make history in style. And a new PvP map, Fort McNair. Title Update 3, Operation Dark Hours. Sets the ground for the epic fight over the control of the city. Fight side by side with your friends in the first ever eight player raid. You and your team need to gear up to face this challenge as it will put you to the test and require expert coordination to be completed. This update also adds the first class fight assignments. And title update four will bring the fourth specialization and its lethal new signature weapon. Get instant access to three new specializations as they release and uncover the secrets of the fall of D.C. with the Year One Pass. The battle for D.C. has just begun. Play it on the world's most powerful console. All right, guys, there you have it. So it looks like we actually have a lot more to look forward to this year, and that is awesome. I really, really have enjoyed this game so far. They have made a huge improvement since the first division, and I hope they continue to even impress me the rest of this year. Guys, I know this video is not a very long one, but I am going to upload another one tomorrow of division gameplay. So make sure you definitely check that one out as well, and I will see you guys next time. Peace. Peace.